Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell. The Vibe Scottsdale murder trial ended its third week today, with defense attorney Tom Tavares Pinson complaining that the matter has been progressing too slowly with only a few days before Christmas. Tavares Pinson made the comment after lead prosecutor Jeremy Taylor told the court that the cybercrimes expert whose evidence had forced the matter to go in camera last week would not be available today or tomorrow. The three suspects charged in relation to the October abduction of two men from their Kirkland Heights home in St. Andrew have been remanded. The outgoing executive director of the Human Rights Group Jamaicans for Justice, Dr. Carolyn Gomes, says she has been receiving support from members of the Jamaica Constabulary Force for the resignation of Police Commissioner Owen Ellington. Dr. Gomes says since making the call, she has been approached by police personnel who have expressed disappointment in the commissioner's leadership and have thanked her for pressing the matter. Prime Minister Portia Simpson Miller is now in South Africa to attend Tuesday's memorial service for former President Nelson Mandela. In sports, the West Indies Cricket Board is now making travel arrangements for the under-19 players to return to the Caribbean after the regional body pulled the team from the ongoing tour of Bangladesh. The withdrawal came yesterday following an explosion near the team hotel in Chittagong. In your weather forecast, tomorrow morning there will be isolated showers over northern parishes. During the afternoon, expect scattered showers and isolated thunderstorm. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.